Mom, what happened between you and Dad? Why did he hit you? It's nothing, my son. Just a personal issue. But Dad never hit you like this before. Something serious must have happened. Please don't fight like this, Mom. I don't like it. I don't want to fight Oleg. But he, he has changed a lot ever since meeting his ex-girlfriend. What? His ex-girlfriend? I don't understand. What are you talking about? Your father is cheating on me, my son. He has started having an affair with another woman. No, mom. That can't be true. Dad loves you. He loves us. He would never do that. He doesn't love me anymore, Oleg. I know him better than anyone. He is different now. But why, mom? Why would he do this? We are a family. How can he destroy that? Sometimes, people forget the love they once had. Maybe I wasn't enough for him. Don't say that, mom. This is not your fault. You have always been the best mother and wife. Thank you, my son. Your words mean everything to me. Don't worry, mom. I'm here for you. I will never leave you. You are my strength, Oleg. I'm so lucky to have you. I love you more than anything. Mom, I found the perfect apartment. I love it so much. I really want to buy it. That's wonderful, honey. I'm so glad you found something you love. Your happiness is my happiness. Thank you so much, Mom. You are the best mom in the whole world. Thank you, my sweetie. You make me proud every day. I will send the payment to the dealer right away. When are you planning to move in? Victor and I are planning to come here today. We have already packed and arranged everything. That's quick. I'm happy for you, sweetheart. Just let me know if you need anything else. Mom, are you okay? You sound a little sad. Is everything all right? I'm fine, honey. Don't worry about me. I'm just a little tired, that's all. Now go enjoy your new place, my sweet Anya. I will. I love you so much, Mom. I love you too, honey. Take care of yourself and Victor. I need your help. There is someone I want you to deal with. You have to kill her. All right, I can handle it. But you know my price. I know. That's why I'm here. I will give you $50,000. But you have to make sure the job is done right. $50,000 is good. All right, who is the target? Her name is Tina. Everything you need to know is in there. Her photo, her address. You came to the right person. I will handle it. When do you want this done? As soon as possible. She is becoming a problem. All right, but I will need some advance money to get started. Here is $20,000. You will get the rest after it's done. I see. You are serious about this. Don't worry. Once I take a job, it gets done. Good. I will be waiting for your call. Remember, no mistakes. Trust me, there won't be. You will hear from me soon. Just go home and let me handle it. Anna, the dinner is ready. Let's have something to eat. Oleg has already gone to bed. 
I'm not hungry. I don't want to eat. Don't be stubborn. Skipping dinner is not good for health. Please come with me. Why do you care? Who am I to you? Today you hit me, tomorrow, who knows what you will do to me. I hate you, Barry. I hate you. Don't say that, Anna. Please. I love you. I know I was wrong, and I'm sorry. But you have to trust me. Trust you? How can I trust you when you treat me like this? You have changed, Barry. You are not the man I married. This is all because of your jealousy. You think I don't love you, but you are wrong. You are the most important person in my life. Don't lie to me. I know you are hiding something. You have been meeting your ex and I can't take it anymore. I told you, there is nothing between us. I only met her because... Because what? Because you miss her. Because you still have feelings for her. No, that's not it at all. Stop lying. Just leave me alone. Just get out. Go sleep in another room. I don't want you here. Anna, this is your anger talking. You don't mean it. I mean every word, Barry. Leave, now. All right. I will go. But please, don't skip dinner. Take care of yourself. I don't need your concern. Who are you? What do you want? Madam, I was on my way home, but I really need to use the washroom. Could you please let me in? All right, come in. The washroom is this way. Thank you so much, madam. I appreciate it. I'm sorry, but this is the end for you. What? How dare you push me? Who are you? You don't need to know who I am. I was hired to finish you. He said you were causing too much trouble. Oh, so Harry sent you, didn't he? Typical coward. But don't mess with me, girl. You don't know about me. I don't care who you are. I'm just here to finish my job. You really don't know who you are dealing with, do you? You think you can harm me? You came to the wrong place, my dear. I warned you. You don't know who I am. I'm far more dangerous than you think. Please don't do this. I'm just doing my job. I will not kill you. Please let me go. Your job. Poor thing. You are not even good at it. Now, you will regret ever stepping into my house. Now be ready to die. Goodbye, sweetie. Harry, I think you were right. Victor isn't the right person for Anya. Finally, you are seeing it my way. I have told you before, Eliza. Victor has trapped her. He knows exactly what he is doing. But what could I have done? 
Anya loves him so much. I didn't want to break her heart. You are her mother, Eliza. Being a parent means making hard choices, even if it makes her sad for a little time. But it's not that simple, Harry. Today they wanted an apartment, and I gave it to them. What if they start demanding more? What if this never ends? It will not stop. That is what I am saying. Victor knows we have money, and he will keep asking until all the money is gone. I don't know, Harry. I thought I was helping her. But now I'm starting to worry. What if she realizes it too late? She is so blinded by her feelings for him. Honey, I need your help now. Come to my house quickly. Harry sent a girl to kill me, but she failed. I killed her, and you need to take care of her body. And about Harry, we need to plan to kill him too. I already have 30% of his company, but I want all of it. Come fast, and we will plan how to finish him.